Hello everyone, welcome. Curious about the Fall AI. This platform promises fast, affordable AI media generation for developers and creatives alike. Today, we'll take a look at it. So let us talk about the key features and benefits now. So firstly, we have lightning fast interference, uh, Fall AI proprietary interference. So firstly, we have lightning fast interference. The proprietary inference engine can generate diffusion model output up to 4x faster than traditional systems. This means quick response, ideal for prototyping and real-time apps. 2. Flexible, pay-as-you-go pricing. With CPU, sorry, GPU access starting at around 0 0.60 uh, cents an hour, like A6000 GPUs at, uh, for example, uh, $0 0.0002 a second, you only pay for what you use. A free tier is available as well. Then we have full site suites of developer uh, tools. Uh, full AI supports text to image uh, generation, text to video, LoRa training, and even web based UI playgrounds, and APIs in Python, GS, and Swift. Uh, it's versatile for both experimentation and production. Then we have enterprise grade reliability, backed by over 100 million daily requests and 99.9 .9 uptime. It's trusted by large products like Perplexity and Photo Room. Reddit users report better and more consistent results with Fall AI when training LoRa models. As one said, Fall AI remembered the object while other platforms did not. Now, uh, cautions and considerations a uh, steeper learning curve for non developers. Uh, and less doc documentation and community support. Uh, potential vendor lock-in if you rely heavily on proprietary APIs. So bottom line, if you're a developer or creative looking for fast, scalable AI uh, deployment with flexible pricing, Fall AI is definitely worth evaluating. So guys, that's pretty much it. Like and subscribe for more such comparisons, reviews and videos. See you very soon.